All right. I can see it is just a gorgeous gray, gloomy, slit your fucking wrist kind of Monday morning in the end times. Well, it's not Monday morning. It is, uh, it is 12.15. I am, uh, I am waking up <clears throat> to my first Monday afternoon here. What do you think, little dog? Is it time to get out of bed? 12.15. Okay, my, uh, my extra drinking and my three bottles of sleeping pills in addition to the extra alcohol must be working. I... I have been in this seven foot by seven foot room now for 15 hours. But anyway, like we all do here on the first Monday of my golden years, I need to ask myself the critical un- avoidable question this is my old hopium addict on ray named ray cats on uh, medium.com today so ray what is the critical unavoidable question the question is what do i do right now what do i do right now it is 12 15 on a nasty yuck slit your wrist kind of monday so what does a 65 year old do uh at 12 15 in the afternoon well what does ray do this is how ray approaches life's insistent question I can't really give advice on this, except to suggest that you should ask yourself this question every day. What do I do right now? Hmm. Ask yourself this question every day to ensure that you have made at least one conscious choice about how to live there you go within the limits of your situation you, you know uh, since so many people i uh, make unconscious choices about how to live way outside the limits of their situation so within the limits of my situation in a way you will not regret. Okay. What do I do right now with my conscious choice about how to live within the limits of my situation in a way I will not regret? In other words, you may make mistakes, but if you at least make conscious decisions, then you are more in charge of your life and should have fewer regrets. Personally, I do a kind of daily triage. There you go. I think that each day I should first of all live the day as fully as permitted, seize the day, yes, live the day fully as permitted. That means I try to, I try to consciously embrace the human experience. So I need to get out there and I need to consciously embrace the, hum, the human experience here on uh, Monday afternoon. September 23rd, 2024. Is there something I feel the desire to create today? Yeah, 
is I need to create a cup of coffee at 12.30 in the afternoon. And then I need to create going to Ithaca to the liquor store. It's not so even so much the liquor store, although I'm going to stop there. It's now that I've, you know, increased by 50% the number of margaritas. It's the fucking limeade. Uh, I, I need to create about a, a, a 12 pack case of limeade in my life along with my tequila so that is what i am going to make the conscious decision to do to create some margaritas uh, okay do i want to take a walk and daydream yeah there's a beautiful day to do that be in nature? Be in nature, huh? Do I want to be with friends today? Do I want to be with friends? There you go. I, How many friends uh, in the last couple of days have I sent uh, messages to do not come visit me at Bugs in a Jar Farm? Uh... Do I want to be with friends today or engage with strangers? I want to engage with the uh, cashier at the liquor store and the cashier at Wegman's grocery store. Are these strangers I want to engage in? Although I don't think the cashier at the liquor store is that much of a stranger anymore. Why is my... Everything looking like it's in Vaseline right now. What is going on with this fucking camera? Those kinds of experiences, not jobs, not jobs and economic activity. Well, that is a good thing to know. What is going on with my, I guess it's all of this rain and clouds and shit fogging up my, uh, fogging up my uh, lens not jobs and activity are the stuff of life whatever moves you challenges you emotionally challenges me emotionally uh, getting out of bed at uh, at 12 30 in the afternoon or intellectually Yes, reading this crap on medium.com. Indeed, what is really important is exactly the opposite of what we have been told. And uh, so it now looks like my my camera is I don't I don't know what this is. So anyway, little dog, uh This is some weird shit. So I don't know if it's if it's gonna look like this on the I guess some sort of moisture has gotten inside the camera. Alright, little dog. Go out there and get your chippies at twelve thirty in the afternoon. <laughs> oh Lord, I you know, I absolutely love uh, this shit with this camera. I, I wonder if this is is, is just going to be from here on out what my uh, what my camera is is going to look like. This is uh, my life. So let me go create a cup of coffee through the gloom. I'm going to create a cup of coffee. Alright. We're going to create a big cup of coffee this, this afternoon. Create a big cup of coffee. Getting out of bed at 1230. 
this is the this is the latest I have gotten out of bed, brother, in uh, the year 2024. Now my camera is all fucked up. Oh Jesus! Beautiful day. Uh, all right, now I have to go out to the trailer and create something else. You know, and this really is this camera. I mean, I, <laughs> this is uh, could not be a better. Uh, this could not be a better metaphor for uh, looking at life. So here I am going into the former Maggie May trailer. The Maggie May, the former Maggie May trailer. And I am going to create something. This will be the probably the the main thing I create today here in this five gallon bucket. <sighs> My life. This is <laughs> this is this is my life oh fuck well the camera seems to have cleared up in the Maggie Mae trailer this is the uh, this is the kitchen in the Maggie Mae this is this is actually the bathroom in the Maggie Mae but I have moved the uh, the bathroom over to the to the bedroom Anyway, I think I will uh, shut the camera off now because I really don't think you guys need to watch me make my daily creation to add to the planet while I still can. Bye, guys.